G'day ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the Minor Magic 6 playthrough. I'm your host Huey Plays, and welcome back to episode 27, I believe. We are definitely in the mid game now. I mean, look at us go. We can all level up. This is the state of play. We are just, as I like to say, we are rocking and rolling. We are. Where are we at? We are at the Temple of the Snake. And if you know your Might and Magic 6 well, you will know that this contains the legendary Q. I'm pretty sure. 99% sure. And also the Gold Dragon. So, last video I said that would be our first encounter with a dragon. I was wrong. It'll be our second because we killed. Oh, that scared me. Um, Long Fang Witherhide, I think was his name. Uh, let me put day of protection against these Medusas. Uh, what else? Shield. And there's civilians in here for some reason. I don't know the law behind that. If you know, let me know down below. That'll be appreciated. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. And of course, I want to get heroism. I'm keen for Temple of the Snake. Very keen. Well, we're in a good spot here. Gorgons are the toughest. Yeah. If we go here, we should... Oh, jeez. We should be okay here. Except for the Gorgon. Come on, you know, you want to come here. Hello. I need some scrolls of... Um, Of, uh, whatchamacallit. Ooh, very good. We shall sell that, of course. Oh, yeah, we've got Lord Kilburn Shield, which we've been longing for for a while now, so that's always nice. I forgot about that, actually. Um, we need some scrolls of, um, to reverse if we get, um, what's the word? Stones? Medusas are one of my favourite enemies. There was something satisfying about being able to kill them. I don't know. It's hard to explain. I'm sure you know what I mean. <laughs> but yeah, I think... Um, there's a quest in here. Uh, I think it was the rescue... Yeah, rescue rescue -y. Good English, Huey. <laughs> rescue Emmanuel from the Temple of the Snake. And re return him to Joanne Kravitz. Alright, there's still a few Medusas based on my mini-map. Move peasant. We can take on all the normal Medusas just fine. Hello, en Enchantress. Look at Pablo with his 70 damage. Charlotte in the 50s. Even Steph is getting mid 40s. Oh, I'm liking that chest. That's always got the good stuff. Alright, Charlotte. I'm trusting you. Holy. Wow. I mean, I'll take the potion bottles. So we've got everything else. Um, beautiful. Just identifying them. Okay, awesome. Uh, who do we got in here? 
Hello, peasant. Who I can't interact with. Um, alright, what's down here? Where's the shoot? Oh god, alright. Ooh. And from memory, actually. Why am I being damaged? Interesting. Okay, we've got some basic stuff in this chest. We'll take the gold. So it always interests me, like, some medium and, you know, tough dungeons have some basic stuff in their chests. But then some just have, like, an amazing loot. Okay, this is a big test, because we got a gold dragon here. Now, the... Off. I don't know if we'll be able to kill this dragon. I have my doubts, because look at that. I can do. Fixed. One hit in the Charlotte just went down by over 100 for sure. Uh, I'll try. That's all I can do is try. Uh, power cure. I mean, what I could do... What's this? Um... Mass Distortion. Well, that didn't work. Uh, um... Dragon's Breath. Take some of your own medicine. Ah, uh, Mass Curse. Uh, oh, we had Paralyzer. Yes, Paralyze. Well, that did not work. Um. Yeah, let me just spam attack. Jeez, always. See, we're still a long way from uh, taking on dragons. But to be fair, gold dragons are the toughest, I'm pretty sure. And we've almost got them down to yellow, maybe. Um. Oh, come on. Come on down under us. God, look at that damage. God, no one's getting in the hit. Good Charlotte. Oh my god. How did we get gold dragon in here? That's what I want to know. Yeah, look, this isn't working out for us, is it? We're barely getting in any hits. My god, this is, um, pretty unreal. Oh, Pedro with the goods. Nothing I can do. Let me see how Incinerate goes. Seven. Oh my goodness. This has been a bit of a calamity. Um... Yeah, look. <laughs> we are definitely not doing that. That's, uh, that's suicide. Um, we'll open the chest here. Hopefully these. Uh, it's not good enough for us to enchant. I don't think. That is. I can't learn that. Aha. Stone. No, I want different scrolls. Yeah, look, we are a long way away from taking on gold dragons. But hey, I know that coming in here. I just wanted to see how we stacked up. We don't stack up. 
Another peasant. Alright, let's see what's up around here. Oh, oh. What? That's interesting. Um, they can come in, but we can't. Um, when they take it, this Gorgon. And the Enchantress. Good thing they're not hitting us. Alright, Gorgon is next. Hello, Gorgon. Wowie. Oh, I don't want to be stoned. It had to be Pedro, didn't it? Uh. Oh, I can't let it be Pedro because he's the only one that can, um. Oh. Okay, this might be a bit frustrating. Um. I don't know. You don't know. Mm. I feel like the only way, actually, is to go down where the dragon is, press the lever, and go um, into that passageway. Wow. Pretty sure that is the only way. Hello, peasant. Oh, so that's a teleporter. That's interesting. Um... So, whatever attack is there is just following us, seemingly. See, look at that. What we can do is try and take out who we can. I'll save here. Just in case I get stoned. Ooh, we've got two Gorgons. Look at out. I'll take you on first. Oh, yeah, okay. Um, uh, Alright. Okay, look, it's Earth, actually. So I could have. I could have stuck with it before. As, all right, as long as Steph doesn't get, you know, stones, we'll be right. Can you stop stoning uh, Charlotte, please? My god. Um, stone flesh. Shit, she's only on one... Uh, it's power cure. Oh my god. It's all happening, ladies and gentlemen. Come on, two more hits. She's gone. Two more hits. Oh, are you serious? How did nothing hit? There we go. We shall save. Okay. So if we... That's a very weird walking motion. <laughs> He's just like walking on his side. Jesus. This is intense. Alright. Who are you? Um, alright, look, let me save.
I'm gonna have to press the button when the dragon is. Yeah. Oh god, hello. Yeah, yeah. Nice to meet you. Okay, running, jump. God, I can see why this can be a tricky dungeon. You gotta know what you're doing. Because otherwise you can get in some serious trouble. I mean, if the dragon, a gold dragon, nevertheless, was, wasn't was a giveaway, then I don't know what is. At least we haven't encountered any uh, titans. Because that's uh, something else, too. Pretty sure there's a Titan uh, stronghold as well, and if my memory serves me correctly, then I am pretty sure the best bow in the game is in the stronghold. I could be wrong. I might be mixing up my Magic Seven. I feel like I am actually. So I'm thinking of uh, is it Avli? If you know what I'm talking about, you know. Yeah, I don't know what I'm thinking about. <laughs> um, well, at least there's no Gorgons. We'll get heroism going for us. So with heroism... Uh, five, seven... Oh, look at Charlotte's damage. Love to see it. Baba Medusa. Stop stoning me. Unbelievable. All right, come on. Good bow damage. Ah, uh, stone the flesh. We may have to rest somehow. But I have my doubts we'll be able to do that. So I don't know how we're going to combat this. Oh jeez. Yep, hello Gorgon. Alright, let's get some big damage. Come on, good Pablo. I think we're gonna get hit by one of these enchantresses, so we should be right. Very good. Yeah, don't worry. Oh, there we go. Go, we're gonna take out the Medusa with one. One hit from everyone. Easy peasy, Japanesey. I don't know. <laughs> I love it when Pedro does that. I don't know. It's funny. Uh -oh. Plus nine spell points. All right, we'll go this way. Oh boy. There's a lot of Medusas this way. I'm assuming... Jesus. It's Med Medusas and not like Medusa I. There are some... I put an I at the end. Like Magi. Um, I'm trying to think of another one, but I can't. <laughs> we'll save. Because they can both stone us right now. Come on, less than halfway. Come on. Right now the Enchantress, let's go. And there's another Gorgon. The down under has got this though. I have full trust in our abilities. Oh, there's two Gorgons. Take out the Gorgon here. 
Yeah, don't worry. Hold on. <laughs> it's good that the Enchantress is blocking the rest, which is handy. Except when uh, she does that. Thank you. I don't think normal Medusa's stonuts, which works in our favor for sure. Oh, I can't reach. Well, 71, 44, 54, 41. Come on, one more. There we go. There's a lot of Gorgons. Let me save. We're on a good no stone streak here. Let's keep it going. Oh yeah. Love to see it. There was a Gorgon there. I wonder if Emmanuel's in that cage. Um... And I need to remember how to get to Q. So I feel like I'm going to forget. Yes, we Alright. We shall save. I can almost guarantee you Emmanuel's in that cage. Oh yes. This is a little life hack. Thank you. Hello. Hello, Emmanuel Kravitz. Lair of the Devils. I met a man who went to discover the fate of the town of Sweetwater, and he says that the place was burned to the ground by the devils. The devils have built a strange tower near the old town, and eerie noises come from it every 20 minutes. He would have explored further, but there were so many devils near the tower, he did not dare. So now we got Sherman and Emmanuel, who are identical twins, seemingly. Alright. Um. Oh yeah. Oh, look at this bow. Oh, that's a stellar bow. Holy shit. That's the best bow we have got so far. And we are equipping that for Charlotte. Oh my lord. What a beautiful bow. Uh, 3 to 4, 2 to 5. God, what an impressive bow. I don't think we'll be getting rid of that anytime soon. My god. Uh, let's say. Oh, look at this chair. Excuse me. Plus 25 might. Yep, just casually. Plus 23. That is a special. <laughs> Jesus. We've got some good loot. Very, very, very good loot. Um. Fixed. Huh. Didn't realize. Uh, plus 23. Look, I'll tell you what. Our damage isn't going down. Is this better than anyone else's? Or... Yeah, we'll do that for the added armor um, class. Oh! Look at this. Plus 18 armor, plus 11 might. Pretty good. Plus 26 armor, plus 25 might. Don't mind if I do. 
Oh, that, is, oh, no. that is extremely good. Oh, no. Uh, wrong person. Oh, we're gonna have so much money. I mean, look at this already. Alright. Now. Q. How do I find you? Uh, pretty sure... Something to do with around here. I feel. Oh shit. Um. Oh idiot. I should have um Lloyd Bacon. There. Um. Hmm. Alright, look, I'm gonna... Let's go here. I might have a tactic to defeat the dragon, actually. Potentially. And it's to... do this method. But it can get pretty risky if I don't. Now I can't see where he is. Um. Not a work just like new. Increased rate of recovery. Well, I don't think it's sustainable against someone this tough. I mean, look, play gold drag. Well, oh, come on. Shit. Oh, it's into the yellow, into the yellow. Um. It worked. Excellent. Stop moving, dragon. No, oh, let me load. Okay, let me, um... Tamp portal. Okay. Two things. One. I need a heal. G'day. Two. I need to look up, I think, where Q is. Or how to get to Q. Oh. Um. Let me fly there. Um. So, yeah, let me multitask this and. Uh, uh, how do I go down again? Insert. Okay. Because it is going to annoy me. If I don't at least just show you Q. In the room farthest from the dragon. Okay. Um. Let me Lloyd's bacon here. Oh, we still got Tomb of Efric. All right. Let me see what it says here.
Okay, I think I know how to get the queue. Oh, this. Hold on. This could be. Dragon seems to be. St oh. I was hoping the dragon would be stuck. So, apparently, there's a secret wall in here. So let me press my space bar. Oh, here we go, here we go. Okay, important thing about Q is Q has like five to 10,000 hit points or something ridiculous and the only move he knows is eradicate which means beyond death and we don't have that spell to I don't think because I think there's one here that's like um, we don't have um oh no we do have race dead there's one lock above it it's like Revive from um, eradication or something, but where is it? Die. Yep, and he says die. So let me save. I need to get him. Die. I need him glitched. Not glitched, but st So like here. Would be perfect. Come on, Q, you know you wanna stay there, buddy. I really wanna know the backstory behind Q. Like such just a random thing. Well here would be good. Okay, let's save here. He can't get us, so... I think this is gonna work. Heroism would help. And apparently in that chest, I have defeated Q before. It's like... I think Lloyd's Beacon and Town Portal. But he also drops a special item which I want to get, which I shall show you. So yeah, he's got like 10,000 damage, so, you know, we're just gonna have to be patient. Probably take a few minutes. But at least we can defeat Q this way and, you know. Whereas, like the gold dragon, you know, we can't get that stuck. But I do want to try and take out the dragon. And I do have a method which I used against Longfang with a height. And that was pretty successful, as you know, if you've watched that video. God, which is probably. God, how many videos ago now? Uh, well, I. S I'd have to say, like. We're up to 27, 15 videos ago, potentially, 12 to 15. Got to put in perspective how much damage this person has. He's still on green. We've been at it for over a minute. So this is going to be like five minutes. Yeah, I want to really, really want to know the the lore and the backstory behind this. 
Obviously, must be like a developer's, you know, inside joke or something, or, you know, hidden meaning. I'm sure I could look it up. You know what? While I kill Q, let me actually look it up. Uh, how did Q in MM6 uh, be in the game? Yeah, be in the game. Or something like that. Alright, we're on to the wiki. We'll see what it says, hey? The fandom wiki, which we have utilised before. Holy sh... Alright. 16,000 hit points. I didn't know he had that much. He has 60 armour class. I mean, look at him. He's got absolute rolls of muscle. His damage is 10d5 plus 2. His attack speed is 100. Spells, Finger of Death. We can actually learn that ourselves. Um, spell use, 10%. He's level 100. And... Only has 75 experience, I think, he gives us. Oh, he's into the yellow. Let's keep at it down under us. Treasure. I won't say the treasure yet. Because if you don't know, I want to keep it a surprise. So, it says he uses the finger of death 10% of the time. That's an absolute lie. He's using it 100% of the time at the moment. Or 80%. And ranged magical attacks the rest of the time. He's immune to magic damage. And he guards two chests. That's all there is on him. Hmm. Let me go to a different wiki. God, almost there. Let's go, let's go. Um, so this one I'm reading from Magic Game World says he has 5,000 or 10,000 hit points. Yeah, triple that. <laughs> Jeez Louise. Um, yeah, so he drops an item which I want to show you, which I will use. And it's a feature that is in Minor Magic 7 and 8, but not this game, unless you have this item. Uh, I just scrolled down and I saw... RP Genie. 15 years ago, he uploaded MM6 265 Boss Q. I remember watching that years ago. Like at least 10 years ago, like 2012. I've mentioned before, but RP Genie was an absolute uh, inspiration for me growing up. Loved his uh, Modern Magic videos. Then he just dropped off the face of the earth. And I've tried somehow to find out, uh, you know, how he's doing. Or what's going on, but obviously he was anonymous, like on the name RP Genie, so you know, I just have no way of knowing, so hopefully well, hopefully he's still around and okay um, that's all you can hope for he's down into the red now Q, let's go down under his let's go, we've ran out of heroism um Alright, just a couple more minutes and we got him. Alright, now I'm on the FAQ for Q. Oh my god, updated in 2003? 19 years ago? How old is this? Um, who 
Who is Q? Q is an inside joke that the creators of Minor Magic 6 put in. They loved them um, some Star Trek and as you can see if you played the game at any length they put a ton of Star Trek references in this game. Admittedly I haven't seen Star Trek, don't hate on me. <laughs> uh, to get back to the question though, Q is one of the toughest characters to fight in the game, one of the longest battles you will ever fight. Um, question, he's that tough? Answer, to coin a phrase from good old JR, that man is tougher than a $2 steak. Oh, good old Jim Ross. Legendary commentator, wrestling commentator, who is currently with All Elite Wrestling. The best show out there, bar none. Good old JR. So it just goes into like how to beat him. It's probably the method I'm using. Which I mean, I would like to take him on head on. But I'd have to save and probably lie that many times. You know, it's... I don't necessarily want to do that. <laughs> and I don't want to die. Over and over, so... We are almost there though, come on. The home stretch now, the home stretch. Let's go. Come on, Q. Oof, we are getting there. And call me crazy, but I do want to take on the dragon. And I already have twice, but we're pretty much full health here. I have a strategy, I just want to try it. I'm going to put on all the buffs. All the buffs. And I'm just going to try something. Alright, I'm going to save here. Now I'm going to face him head on. You're nothing to me, Q. Look at you. Pathetic. 93 cut. And a horn. You read that correctly. The horn of Ross. A horn from the dragon Ross, killed during the night of the shooting stars. This horn enables its owner to more accurately sense the wounds of his opponent. So, if we were to right click on an enemy, we'll be able to see how many hit points it has left, so I'm pretty sure. Well, we took a lot of damage. Um, Ooh, Mystic Wand of Death. Well, don't know. Um, shrinking. I mean, we'll sell these. Easy gold. We'll save. Rest. Well, don't know. Town Portal, Lloyd's Beacon, Stone the Flesh. I can't learn that. I can't learn that. I can't learn that. I can't learn, I can't that. learn that. I mean, I can sell. I can't learn, I can't learn that. that. We'll somehow get Charlotte to learn it. Alright, let me save again. Well, where are you? Yeah, there we go at the bottom. Hit points 280. Oh my god. Alright, let me just. Oh shit, not quit. Uh, let me load. I had a feeling I was gonna get encountered at some point. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, what I want to do is take on the dragon, as I've said. Oh, actually, I've got another idea. Oh, it's only a one-way door, okay. So what I was thinking, maybe, was to go through this way and just see if I can hit from, like, where... You know, um, from there, but I can't seem to get in. Bugger. 
Let me go up here, see where it takes me. It's probably teleport to go back to the front. Let's see, hey? Daily reminder to drink your H2O. Hmm. Oh god. <laughs> My uh, water bottle went on the keyboard. Yeah, as I thought, went back to the start. Yeah. Alright, yeah, as I said, call me crazy, but I want to take on this gold dragon. And if I can't do it, then I pledge that I will come back here and defeat it. I will not let it defeat me. And I don't think there's cold beam now. Well, can we shoot from... Going for the head. Let me suck, if. Oh, hold on. Oh, okay. Alright, so it's better just to go head on here. So, my method of madness is. Alright, so it's got 1250 hit points left. We defeated Q, who had, you know, like 12 times as much. This is nothing to us. Anyway, um, my thinking and my method here. Let me load. I want to put buffs on, I forgot. My bad. Um, day of protection. And last but not least, last but not least, oh come on, push that one does it, um, air of power, that's my favourite sound effect, I'm going to save here, oh you person, I don't want to get hit, if I can help it. Alright, my method here. Let me save. I'm gonna pause, get hits in, then pause again before the dragon hits me. Shit. Hold on. So I pause. Uh, I gotta get the timing right, it's a bit finicky. Fixed. Um Fixed. I probably don't need to repair the rings, really. Nothing I can do. Um. All right, 1,114. We'll do another save. Ah, oh, no, I don't want you doing it. See, so like, just before he attacks. Um. Fixed. Now to work just like new. I oh, don't mind if you hit Pablo because he's our tank. Jesus. Um, let me do power cure and save. Oh, 976. Um, sorry if the pausing is annoying you. <laughs> Just think it is for the greater good here. 815, let us save. Oh, that was good sequence. Oh yeah. Under 600, let's go. Power QR, let me save. 487. So this is like exploiting the game mechanics, but you know. It's a gold dragon. We gotta do what we gotta do. Same with Q. Oh, 225. Power QR. Save. Oh, good damage. 143. Alright, from here, I wanna see if I can do it without. Let's do it proper. 
Oh, you absolute coward of a dragon. Really? You know, let me get on top of you. Let me power cure. Let me save in the second. 50. Yes! We owned that dragon. We owned that dragon. Fixed. Alright, one hit repairing. It ought to work just like new. God, look at the down oh, under his go, hey? We have defeated. I don't know. Oh god, that's a good halberd. No. <laughs> no. We have defeated Q. The Gold Dragon. And rescued Emmanuel. Talk about a good day at the office. Okay, let's identify this halberd. <laughs> wow. Elite Halberd of the Dragon. Plus 10 attack, 3d6 plus 10 damage. Adds 10 to 20 points of fire damage if you don't mind. And 25 might. I can do. It ought to work just like new. That's nuts. God, alright, okay. Ah. Alright, let's go back to Blackshire, shall we? Uh, we need to go to Kravitz. Wasn't that the cook's house? Greetings. Um, she's disappeared now. Hello. Quest. Oh, thank you for bringing Manuel back to me. Nothing in this world means as much to me as him. Please take this as a reward. Oh no, it's not much, but you deserve it for bringing him back to me. You know what, Joanne? You know what I went through to get back your presumed, uh, presumed. Oh my god, I can't speak. Presumably your husband. I deserve a lot more than 500 gold. Give me your house. <laughs> I mean, look at how much gold we have. We don't need it. Alright, let's level up. Because look at this. I reckon we can do it a couple times. Oh, what a fruitful video. I think once I level up... Um... You know, sell everything. It's closed. Uh, you bugger. How about okay, okay, okay? No way. Oh, you only got six hundred. We shall end the video there. But, oh, look at this. Look at our skill points. Okay, Pablo. Bodybuilding the 12. Learning up. Give me more experience. Charlotte, what about you? We can get Master Chain. Master Bow. Uh, merchant doesn't matter. I don't know what to do. Um, guess learning and merchant. Uh, Pedro, dark magic, meditation, oh yeah, he's into the 400s, let's go, and two more than Steph, alright, Steph, fire magic for you, need that up to 12, and then we'll do earth, which is stuck on a measly four, okay, beautiful stuff. Now let's sell, hey? Um, is everything identified here? Increases effect of all water spells. Interesting. Um, don't think we need that. If it was like fire, or like offensive spells, then probably. But otherwise, yeah, no. We are making very good progress, ladies and gentlemen. Um, Alright, look. Well, let me go over here first. Look at our goal go up. You ready?
Got everything is full value. Oh my lord, look at that. Give me all the wands. The Horn of Ross. I want to put Horn of Ross there. Thank you. Um, anything else? Just the Hellbird. Can I help you find anything? Boom, 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 boom. Thanks. Come again. God, we've sold like... We're gonna sell like sixty thousand dollars worth of stuff. Finest weapons in the land. Come again. Oh Lord, Kilburn Shield actually, I forgot. Don't Completely forgot. Come back oh yeah, and let me deposit um, What can I do for you? Let me deposit hundred and fifty thousand. Thank you very much. Please services. Okay, let me town portal to New Sorpagal. What day is it? I think on the Wednesday we can travel. Need a ride? Oh yeah, Hit eight gold. Person. Cheers, Aaron. Love your work. All right, let's fly over here. One thing I want to do. Charlotte's just an archer. I want to promote her. Everyone else is. Pretty much the highest, and Pablo as well can be promoted again. Master Nikolai Iron Fist, Prince and heir to the throne. Ah, this is a sad day when so noble a knight should fall to such fair monsters. You have done a good thing, bringing his shield to me. I shall ensure that he and his men receive all the honors due them. I am in your debt, and you have my favor with the council. Here's your reward. Well, you have my vote on the high council. I trust you implicitly. I've sent a messenger instructing Slicker Silvertongue to vote for you on my behalf. Now I'm quite busy and must attend to other duties. I'm sure you can take care of any problems and miscommunications that may arise in this matter. Yes, quite right. Um, so I noticed something with Uncle Archibald Iron Fist. And he's up. Um, he's in the library. He's there. I know there's like a quest or something at some point. Where he comes to life and we can talk to him, I think. How are you today? Um, hold on. Does diplomacy help with your reputation? It's respectable, still. Hello. Um, expert learning. John Tuck is a master. He's in Silver Cove. Hmm. Okay. You know what? I'm feeling adventurous. I want to try and defeat the warlord, which I think is in the frozen highlands. And we can level up again. <laughs> Let's uh. Go to Freehaven. I don't think there's a limit here. Oh, uh, where are we? How about some training? Okay. Oh, we can almost level up. Again with Charlotte. Alright. Again, let's distribute some points. Um. Hmm. <laughs> Master Bow would be good. I think we should do that. Go for it anyway. Uh, Charlotte, you can already get Master Boo. Uh, let's get your bodybuilding up. More hit points, can't go wrong. Uh, Pedro, what about you, my friend? Uh, body magic, get that up to 12. And Steph, fire magic, we can almost get that master, so let's go. Alright, I think it's time to wrap it up here. Uh, let's look at the state of play. We're all into the 40s with our levels. Let's go. Pablo's almost 600 hit points. You love to see it. 
Pedro and Stephanie's hit, uh, spell points are above 400. Beautiful stuff. Everyone's armor class is pretty much the same. Damage is as balanced as you can get. And everything is just going superbly. So I'm thinking for episode 28, we shall take on the Warlord. Because I think that's the promotion to get Pablo to a champion, is it? I'm going to say a champion. So that's my thinking. We'll do that. And then we'll probably suss out how to get Charlotte to whatever her highest promotion is. Which I cannot think of at the moment. But, as always, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for joining me. I truly do appreciate you being here, joining the Down Underers and me on this journey. We are cruising through. Join me in the next video for episode 28. I hope you have a fantastic day. It's been Huey, Huey Place. Cheers.